Welcome guys to this video where we want to talk about how do you actually start a YouTube channel this successfully. This is something we've been wanting to talk about. Yeah, because look, this I is think, what's fun to talk about. I honestly think a lot of people have like that. That's their goal. That's their dream is to have a successful YouTube channel and be an influencer and shit like that, right? And I have a lot of friends that have tried it, and I just I see a lot of people fail, and I know why. I know why they're failing. So I want yeah. to talk about how do you actually start a successful YouTube channel mm -hmm. in 2019? Let's go find a place to sit, cause. Um, because we have to. Yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking. Let's go over here, on oh, this couch. Oh yeah, we didn't talk about beforehand where to sit. Yeah, yeah, that's completely. Yeah. On, on the spot. Okay, let's set this bad boy up right. and get to talking. Put this tripod right here. Go like here, and good. Okay, that was perfect. Easy. Yeah. Good. Yep. Let's. Okay. All right. So where do, where do we start? So this is something I've been wanting to talk about for a while because this is what I geek out about now. Oh, I, yeah. I mean, our YouTube channel is uh, what I care the most about. I was just about right to now. say, like, publishing is great and I love it. I don't love it. Like, I don't have a passion for it. You know, I'm passionate I'm for the money that it makes. Yeah, and but that's it. And, but I am passionate about teaching others yes, and just... making YouTube videos and shit like that. So yeah. I love talking about this subject. Right. So, like, yeah, what gets me really excited is releasing videos and shit mm. like that. Mm. So one of... Our big goals right now is growing the YouTube channel a lot, so we're gonna be pumping out a lot of videos mm -hmm. over the next six months plus, because that's what we want to do. All right, enough talking about us. Let's talk about the point of video. <laughs> Sorry. So, how do you successfully start a YouTube channel? So let's talk. I we, wanna... we agree on this. What the biggest mistake is? Uh huh. Yeah, okay. I see. I, I see this all the time, and that is people that start a YouTube channel without anything to offer. Yep, exactly. You that. need to have something to offer. Yeah. And it's great that you're starting. That that's you're amazing. making your first videos. Mm -hmm. uh, but I, I, I don't think people should be starting until they have that yeah. that thing. So it's like, I feel like a lot of people are making YouTube videos from a selfish point of view. Mm -hmm. Like, they're making videos because, oh, you want to watch me do this. You want to watch me do do this and that. You want to watch me, me, me. It's all about me. Watch me, watch me. I can't stop looking right? at this spider. I know, I know. That's on your coffee glass. Get out of here. Wow, that was so brave. That was not a big spider. <laughs> As I was saying, one of the big mistakes is people making, yeah, videos that are just about me, 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 me. Because mm -hmm. they think everyone wants to hear about me, 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 me. But in reality, no one gives a fuck about you. Mm -hmm. That's the truth. And they, that honestly is when what When people is. watch YouTube videos, it's, they're obvious, they're, I mean, it's pretty obvious when you think about it. They're there for their own reasons. Right. And the reason that, that the, the two, two reasons that yes. people watch videos on YouTube is either to learn something or to be entertained. Yep. So education or entertainment, those are the two reasons uh -huh. that so, people watch YouTube videos. So you need to know beforehand which, uh, what you want to offer of those two, and preferably both. Yeah. You, don't need, you don't need to pick one or the other. So our goal with the channel mm -hmm. is to provide a lot of education, mm -hmm. uh, a lot of value on that side of things, but also make it fun to watch. Because mm -hmm. there's a lot of posting channels, but f I'm, a, I'm just gonna say, I'm just gonna say fucking it. boring to talk about. Zero of them are watchable from yeah. an entertainment yeah. point of view. Did I step on zero? some toes? Zero? Did I step on some toes zero? Right there? <laughs> Insert that meme. Oh, with Kermit the Frog? Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that's the first thing you have to do. Mm -hmm. Figure out if it's gonna be entertainment, education, preferably both. And also, if you want YouTube to be like your business for life, Mm -hmm. It's obviously to make money. Mm -hmm. Entertainment is much harder to to monetize than, yeah. than education. Oh, yeah. So, so from that, I, I feel well, like it's not as, people's goals is not necessarily to make money with the channel. Okay. But if it is, Fair. if it Fair. is, if it is, it should be a education based channel mm -hmm. with some entertainment as well because that's mm -hmm. what helps the most. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Just like vlogs. I don't know how do you even monetize it? Uh, AdSense. So you just have, you to, have to like have a million subscribers to, to make like good full time income yeah. from a vlog channel. So at, at that point, like you it, gotta really love it, right? And I think a lot of people do really love it. Yeah. So let's yeah, talk about that quick. It's a lot of work. Let's talk about that quickly. To make money with vlogs, you need so AdSense. You need tons of views. That's not easy. And then what other things can you AdSense offer? AdSense pays pennies. Pays yeah. fucking pennies. And what else can you offer? Merch. Yeah, merch. And I can't think of what much else. Yeah. So if you want to make money with a YouTube channel, do not make vlogs. So that's w another thing. Like there are so many dead vlog channels because they're like, oh, everyone wants to watch my life. Everyone wants, everyone wants to see me live my life. Like, no, no one cares unless you have something to offer. 
So that could be one. You uh, better be well, one entertaining, no, see, outgoing. Yeah, one awesome motherfucker. One is you have, must have an insane personality that just makes people want to watch watch it. Yeah. Makes people want to keep watching. Or number two, you need such an insanely epic life that mm. people want to keep watching. Mm. If you don't have one of those things, like doing a vlog is going to be really tough. Back to the point at hand. What do you do? You need to offer value to the viewer mm -hmm. and it, offer value. And this was, um, I don't one know, last thing when we were first one, one last, so you have to put yourself in the shoes of the viewer. Yeah. So 100%. it's all about providing to them. Don't think about yourself. Mm -hmm. Don't think about, oh, I want to make videos about this. This is what they want to see. It doesn't matter what you want to make. You have to serve the audience and make videos that they generally want to see and that they're going to take a lot of value from. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when we first started our channel, providing value without asking for anything in return was mm -hmm. like, that's all like we thought about. That was our goal the whole time. Mm -hmm. If you ever noticed, we never like offered anything for sale, didn't try and make any sort of money for six months. Yeah, and six months. It was and five our, months. Yeah, but five months. Until people were begging for a course. Exactly. We, our goal was never to make a course or start making money for honestly I, I honestly wasn't thinking so much. I honestly wasn't even thinking about it. Mm -hmm. I was like I just want to grow the channel like that's not important. I'm mm -hmm. not trying to make money right now like I just really need to provide value. Provide value and like engagement. I think if you really want to build like a, a big YouTube channel you cannot you cannot start start selling anything within like the first few months oh yeah no you know? that's another huge problem i seen youtube they try channels monetize so early yeah oh that's a massive 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 problem so it's like people will start a youtube channel and right off the bat they're already off they're always already putting things up for sale before they've even offered any value yeah exactly yeah. so and that turns people off selling mm -hmm. turns people off people don't want to be sold from they want to buy from you which is our goal we don't try to sell you on anything we try to make you want to buy things like exactly the course, I, I, I hate trying to booster program i hate trying to like offer shit and like trying to convince you to buy this because this is so awesome give like, me money no like here it is throw your money at me here it is and if you think that you can get value from it and it's worth it then you will buy it i'm not gonna try and fucking force you to buy yeah, it. yeah and use all these sales tactics and shit yeah another thing oh here's another big one so we're talking about how to start or how to grow both how to both, both. okay so i guess we'll start with how to start okay so people don't know this like We've had our YouTube channel for like six months now. It's probably approaching seven. Yeah. But before that, me and Rasmus had talked about starting a YouTube channel basically every single day for eight months. Yeah. Every day we're like, okay, Rasmus, we're ready. Rasmus, this is the step. We have to make YouTube videos now. Like we know this is part of achieving all of our goals. Like a YouTube channel is necessary. It took us eight months to actually do it because we were really fucking scared. Yeah. It was really, really, really scary. And, and you probably feel the exact same way, and that's okay. That's normal. Like, if you think, like, something's wrong with me, everyone else that starts a YouTube channel is so confident, and they just kill it from the way of getting... No. Like, not at all. Now we feel pretty good making videos. Yeah. Oh, that's like, if you watch our first videos, wow. I was a Can nervous wreck. please Yeah, please those? don't. Please don't. They were so bad. They yeah. were really, really bad. And really awkward. Now, if you want to, I'm just going to give you the option. You go to videos, and then... Sort by oldest. Yeah. And you can see the first one ever. Yeah, which you can was, see how, sh how... And look, and that, that goes to say, like, your first videos will, will not be, be shit. awesome. Like, that's the same we say That's about, something you need to know. Same we say about your audiobooks. Your yeah. first few will be shit. Yeah. Just because you don't have the experience and everything. That This applies to fucking life. Yeah. Anything Ex you do that you've never done before, the expect first... Expect to be whatever. shitty at it. So, and so how do you get started? Ah, oh, man. They're really... It's like Gary Vee, straight to the point. This is not the answer you want to hear, but it's like, you just have to start. Yeah. You just have to start. Yeah. But when well, like, you have so we value to back. Offer. Exactly, yeah, that's what I was going to say. When you have value to offer. But I'm not saying don't start if like you feel like you don't have value to offer. Because then you might get to the point where you never make videos because you never think you have anything to offer. Mm -hmm. Now you can still make videos and practice and develop your video making skills without anything to offer. You probably won't grow because, mm -hmm. like I said, you have nothing to offer. Mm -hmm. But you're going to become comfortable. I don't want to forget this point. Do you more to say about this? Uh, I'm, no, I don't. I, I have a point that I'm forgetting. I'm going to say it really quick. I'm okay. going to say it real quick. Okay. Uh, consistency. That's how you grow it. Yeah. Consistency. Uh -huh. Uploads. Uploads, 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 uploads. So we did every other day for five months. It is hard work. Yeah. And hard most work. people like to, to have that consistency with their uploads. Like we had every other day for the first five months. We're two people. That's the only way. Yeah. Only oh, way yeah. If possible. I was alone, Mm -mm, that'd be too much. Right. If I did, cause like I out edit a video, you would edit that. Mm, yeah. If I do it all myself. Yeah. Fuck. 
So like, we want that's hard. We want to upload really hard. We want to upload more videos. The only way to do that is to outsource like the video editing, getting a camera guy. We need to streamline the process because it's so much work. Oh, uh, you want to say something? Yes, I do want to say something. I'm forgetting it right now, and I'm pissed. Damn. So more things about how to grow a YouTube channel. Okay. Oh, good audio and good lighting. So that's for well, the lighting quality. Is everything. It's not about quality of your camera. It's about lighting. Lighting and audio. Yeah, just, you, all you need is an iPhone. If you have an iPhone, just film with that for the first oh, oh, I time. Like we did, and people were asking, like, yo, what camera are you using? Because uh, like, as if they were impressed with the camera quality. Yeah, hey, iPhone. iPhone. First 100 videos, iPhone. Uh -huh. So now we have this dope ass camera. This was a big upgrade in quality, uh -huh. but iPhone works perfectly fine. That's all you need. So this is a good opportunity to affiliate market. Like an iPhone, camera, iPhone, uh, a microphone, <laughs> things like that. But no, I won't bother with it. The effort doesn't pay enough. And then, opinion. yeah. Uh, now I remember what I was going to say. Okay. Now I was going to say, can we So this be the last point? Yeah, the let's video. make this the last point. I want to talk about what made us, right? We talked about it for eight months. How, like, let's start this year. Yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. What yeah. finally made us fucking do it? Mm -hmm. Like, what was that breaking point? Yes. Because it, like, there's a good one to end on. Like, there was a thing that happened. And if that thing hadn't happened, then we probably would be now, we would now be 16 months in still saying we got to start a YouTube channel yeah. tomorrow. If this event didn't happen. So for us, I can only speak for us. Mm -hmm. It was a thing that had to happen. Now it's like, well, now you have no choice, motherfuckers. One of, the, wor to do this one of the worst days turned into one of the best days. Yeah. Devastating news is what created this amazing opportunity. Yeah. Yeah, you should say because it's more Okay. You. It was in March when I lost my... 2018. 2018. When I lost my KDP account, publishing account. So I lost like $10,000 in income that was coming in every month. I was like, oh shit, this is not good. This is not this good. This is, is not, not good. good. This is all my money. This is not good. good. Yeah. I still had my audiobooks and that's actually what got us into audiobook publishing as well. Mm -hmm. So then we went hard in audiobooks, made yeah. more money in audiobooks so crazy than we did from everything that, else. Yeah. It created the audiobook thing yeah. and the YouTube channel. So then it just created a mo moment of desperation. We were living in Hawaii. I thought I had to leave Hawaii. Mm -hmm. Because like, Hawaii's I expensive, right? Yeah, so I can't afford to live here. I have to move back home. I have to that, go that, somewhere cheap. That's what the fuck it is. So this moment of desperation, we're like, okay, no more fucking around. We're making this YouTube channel. We know we have to. We ha There's no other choice. Here's a motivator. I can speak for myself. I, I think you'll agree. Mm -hmm. Like, we were living in Hawaii, making good money with publishing. And then when that happened, the idea that, like, fuck, I might have to move back home, start over, like, ugh. So at that time we had one stream of income, or mm -hmm. I had, and then I lost that. Yeah. Uh, and then we started YouTube and things, that's been life changing. Yeah. So a horrible, horrible day. And looking back on it, it's not like I was starving or anything, but to me in my head. But you lost your whole business. Yeah, but it turned out to be amazing and mm -hmm. it changed our lives. So this video is more so how to start a YouTube channel and grow it. Man. I, I do want to make a video how to monetize a small YouTube channel because mm -hmm. we've been pretty good at that so far. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Did I cover it? Yeah, I think so. Most of it. How to get started? You just have to do it. Yeah. The reality, the fact is, that's there's it. No that's secret. it. There is no fucking secret. Like, you just have to overcome this barrier. Like, go outside of your comfort zone, and you just have to attack it. Mm -hmm. I know. You, I know you're scared that people will judge you and think, "Oh, you're sorry, you YouTube channel." It's so you have. You have weird. no choice. It's so weird. You have no choice but to overcome your fear. Yeah. You have no choice. Mm -hmm. So, that's what that is. Thoughts on this topic? Would you like to hear more about this topic yeah. about growing a YouTube channel? Because I think it's one of the most life-changing decisions you could ever make. Mm -hmm. It has been for us, at least. If you, if you want to start a YouTube channel, uh, you're right that it's the right thing to do because it's a life-changing business and mm -hmm. it's so much fun and everything. Yeah. Um, so to get like huge, huge like it's the best of, traffic source in the world. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Fuck Instagram. Fuck Facebook. Fuck yeah. all these. Yeah. YouTube's the spot. Yeah. Would you like to hear more videos on this topic? Ask any questions. Uh, okay. Oh, it's magic emoji of the day. What should it be? If you watch the video, if you're watching this right now, drop an ant emoji. Yeah. Let's just fucking end this video already. Yeah. All right. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Yeah.